G'day, Daisy. Welcome to the team, mate. Oh, thank you very much. Oh, the first call that we've job. had. No, it's Todd from Bowen Head. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's the first show. Oh, yes. Piss off. <laughs> what a treat this is. I can't let that summer go, Bill. It is one of the worst summers from a brand perspective that I've ever seen. So I'm the celebrity. Get me out of here. That's it. Give it to him, Toddy. It's a platform for rebuilding brands. Yep. Barry Hall, Brennan Favola went in there, turned his life around. <laughs> yes. Even Daisy's done a great job. I was holding You're the right only time. person I'm aware of that brand has taken a hit <laughs> by going into that show. <laughs> You oh, were beaten good. by Tanya Hennessy, some <laughs> no-name blogger. Yes. Nikki Osborne, a comedian no one's ever heard of. Yep. Perez Bloody Hilton, Bill. Oh, Perez. He, <laughs> well, that's fair enough. No rare time. No one wants to watch it. No one voted for you. And I hope you realise you've got to wake up to yourself, Pat, and go disappear to the Cremorne. Hey, get stuff. Put him off. Raps, get rid of him. Uh, he's hung up first. anyway. Oh, he has hung up. He's it's gone. our first show and you let Todd on. That is an absolute well, treat, Bill. Well, it said David from Werribee. Oh, David from Werribee. Yeah. Did it? Well... He made some valid points. Bill. No, he didn't. He did. Uh, take a break. It's <laughs> a rush hour, Triple M. Nice. And, and mean, let's hope pubs can open and things like that. No, well, <laughs> Jeez. a bit of self-interest. Yeah, a lot in of self-interest there. Oh, right. Okay. Mm, so. Well, so is that the end of that? Well, hey, Rabs? Yep. Yes. Have we got... Why have I got Gavin from Greensboro coming up on the screen? I don't know. I'll put him on. Gavin. Right, I'll, we've got a call here. This is oh. unusual in the opener. Yes. Hey, Gavin. Gavin. I've got a mate, yeah, Gavin. Yeah, Gavin from Greensboro here, actually. Of course it's not, Bill. It's Todd from Bowen Heads. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't heard from him. Yes. I'm, not sure, uh, I'm not sure if you caught the front page of the Herald Sun today, Bill. The no. source of this, bi- this virus was a bat from Geelong. Let's <laughs> 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 surprise with you, Bill. No, you Geelong idiot. Geelong is the epicentre of the greatest disaster that has ever hit the earth, Bill. <laughs> no, no, Todd, <laughs> he's a scientist. from the jungle with you, fat. He's a, he's a <laughs> scientist <laughs> and studied in Geelong, you flog. Read the story. Just don't make assumptions yeah, like that. The good news for Geelong is with everything closed and nothing going on, life hasn't changed much for the idiots yeah. down there. So that's still behind. They've been in quarantine for 50 years down there. Yeah, now one more thing. I was watching Fox Footy on the weekend, Bill, and oh. I saw your number up on the screen. I thought the Rush Hour family might be uh, oh, interested. No. Uh, oh, yeah. 0419 no, no. me number. Uh, I'm Turn this dickhead off. Oh, he's up. Bill's up out of his seat. But I like these ones down the bottom here, Bill. Brett from uh, Brett Ollie, I think it is. Ollie, yeah. Not enough. Todd from Bowen Heads. Oh, no. Keep fat on his toes. No, stuff. Uh, Daniel says Todd from Bowen Heads isn't on the show permanently. Good. That drives him mad. Yeah, he's a flog. Uh, a final call here. Sam, uh, I think from Scoresby. Sam. Sammy, we got you? Yeah, hello there. Uh, yeah. Uh, what I'll drives you what... mad, Sam? Uh, the the town of Geelong. It's Todd from Bowen yeah. Heads. <laughs> 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 and uh, and I found out recently, Bill, they're looking for places in Australia to film I'm a Celebrity with all the COVID going on because they're trying to film it domestically. Yeah. And I, I figured it's a no-brainer. I want to see a season of I'm in Geelong. Get me out of here. Yeah, <laughs> we, want, uh, nice. we want some sort of primitive backwater. There's one right on our doorstep, Bill. You can <laughs> you can hold all the food challenges at the Cremorne too. Just, you can just serve a standard palmer. That should do the trick. Because the celebrities vomiting all over the joint. <laughs> oh, and... Uh, and I read in this article they're bringing back all the fan favourites as well, Bill. So I don't think you'll be in any danger. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, yeah, Perez will probably get a call up before you. Oh. I'll have the Hawks roll your rabble on Friday as well. Hey, Todd. <laughs> Go off. No. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, he's already taken off. Yeah, he did. He took me oh, advice. I love it. Very <laughs> nice to have Todd back. Haven't heard from him for a while. Oh no, where's he been? I'm not sure. Living in your head? Uh, <laughs> no, he has. I forgot about. Hey, Sarah him. from Doreen wins. Uh, the little kid who uh, locks the toilet yeah. from the wrong side and then crawls out underneath. That's absolutely yeah. brilliant. number seven. Bailey Smith. Who's that's a, a bloody... that's a decent top seven. Number eight. Taryn Thomas. Taryn Thomas is going to be a star. Number nine. Chase Jones. Chase Jones. Number ten. Nick Blakey. So Bill. Hang on. Oh, you're still going? Still going. (laughs) Jai Calder, 11. 12, Zach Butters. Zach Butters. Uh, And then it goes on down to Jordan Clark at 15 and Xavier Dersma at 18. Mm. How good's that That draft, Jim? That is a superstar draft. It's going to be one for the ages, no doubt about Mm. that. I think, uh, have we got a call coming through, uh, Rabbits? Yeah, but we don't. Trent from Trent. Why would we be taking a call off the top? Trent It's been put through by Jill, our producer, Trent. Trent from Trentham, fair to come. Hello, Jim. How are we going? How come you're ringing us off the top? 
Oh, because it's Todd from Bowen. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Reds, turn him off already. <laughs> no, shut up, Pat. What do you got for now, us, Todd? No, I think the Andrews government needs to clear something up for us something up for us because that checkpoint down at Little, Little River there, yep. that's not to keep residents out of Geelong, it's to keep them out of the greater Melbourne area. Yes. Oh, oh, good one. Yeah, good so one. It is so overdue. It is so overdue. In <laughs> fact, I hope it stays there long after this pandemic as well. Perhaps even build a wall there in its place. I reckon that'll I help like us it. all hey, sleep better at night. Todd, and, you're uh, from Bowen Heads, mate. Bowen Heads is open. Yeah, you know, it's a good place to get down to. Bowen Heads isn't too bad. But do you reckon the people down there are even aware that they're in quarantine? Yeah. If you live in Norway, <laughs> would you want to go outside anyway, Bill? Yeah. <laughs> yes. The other thing, those points spread or those fat bet ads that you're doing at the moment. <laughs> I keep seeing them in the, point I bet, you flop. I keep seeing them in the paper. Sort out your dimensions, fat. You look like a fair income smack. Right. The person photoshopping it. I reckon the person photoshopping it was sent into quarantine before they got to finish the job. It was halfway through. And you look like a moron. No, you <laughs> pull them, pull them from the paper. Turn this off. No. Magpies win by 10 goals on oh, Thursday. Piss off, you <laughs> dickhead. <laughs> you look like a fair income smack. You reckon? <laughs> Toby, <laughs> never ring again. To- it's Todd. Yeah, but yeah. Toby, same thing. Oh, He's a dickhead. I love him. Oh, and nah. I, I, I love the access he gets too. Know, he yeah. just rings our switch and gets put straight <laughs> through. Yeah, oh, it, it's a golden show. You know nothing. In mm. fact, you know less than nothing. <laughs> um, all right, so we'll, uh, very welcome, Johnny and Jack from yeah. G-Bunk. Jack. Gee, G-Bunk. 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 G-